Hi guys, welcome back to Crystal's Crochet and Stuff. I am Crystal. I'm actually gonna shut this off, hold on. There we go. Then, the, well, it's still glare. Not much I can do about the glare. Maybe if I sit back here. Perfect, it's not as much. I'll try to stay still. Um, good morning. Uh, I thought I'd hop on. Sorry, that's my washing machine and dryer. Uh, anyway, um, I thought I'd hop on. I have two things I can actually show you that I finished. Um, I don't have a whole lot. I have scratch that. I have a lot done. I have four, six, eight, eight things finished, but I can't show you until the designer decides to release the patterns. One of them I was, I, well, by Friday, if the two patterns haven't been released, I have to come on and do a video because I want to show everybody them because I am giving them to my mom on the weekend. So I have to get a video up for that. Um, hopefully the pattern will be released by then. I thought it would have been released already. So um, hopefully it'll be done. If not, I'm going to come on, show you guys anyway, and tell you who the designer is and stuff. But once the pattern finally does release, I will come back on and show you guys uh, tell you guys where you can get the patterns and stuff. So, I was, it's been a while since I was able to just do something. I was looking on Facebook and I saw a couple things and I, I saw a little bumblebee. Now it's supposed to have a bow, I haven't done the bows yet. I just whipped these up yesterday. So I whipped up this little bee. Um, I will link it down below where I found it. I found it on, um, on Facebook, I'll link it and I'll try to find the actual link to where I found the pattern and then I'll link that too. So I got this little bumblebee done. Uh, it was pretty easy. This you can see this kind of crappy the way I sewed it on. But you can see the joins in the back. This one, this one I did where I was uh, uh, cutting and then rejoining the new color, cutting and rejoining. So you can see the horrible join at the back not big fan of that I'm gonna have to work on that because I don't like that but the front looks good little face the little nose I love the little nose I think it was a cute idea so that's the one that I did the little mini guy and then I used the exact same pattern I should say for that one I just used um brunette um, it's all brunette premium yarn, uh, the black, and then the yellow I had was gold, and then just a white that I had sitting on my shelf. Um, so then I made another one using the exact same pattern, but I used brunette blanket yarn, and the yellow is, I finished off, school bus yellow. So it's brunette blanket brights school bus yellow. And then this one was just a white, and it's just a brunette baby blanket white. And then I had a black, so it's just brunette blanket in black, which I still have, so it's put away on the shelf. So I will show you. <laughs> now keep in mind, this is the exact same pattern. There's no difference, except for the size. <laughs> so this is the, the same B, same pattern, same stitch count, same everything. And this is, and like I said, I didn't do the bows yet. I'm gonna do a big bow for her and a little bow for that one. But I wanted to show everybody. Now this one, you can see the jogging too. And this one I didn't, I did not cut it. I, I carried it up, so I don't know. I gotta learn a way to do that, like seamless, um, seamless joining your new color in so that it doesn't show that, but I mean, it's on the back, I'm not that disappointed. I'm not that angry about it, but it is what it is. So that is the two objects that I was able to get. Can you believe that? That's the same exact pattern as that little one, but just with brunette blanket, so it's way bigger. It's huge. It is, I would say, hold on. Yeah, it's about uh, almost 20, 21 inches tall. So it's very big, filled with a lot of stuffing. And I had to crochet the eyes. Um, I had uh, I had made a couple of stuffies um, from what's her name, Old Soul C C 
Crochet Co. I think it's Valerie. I may be wrong. I'm sorry if I'm wrong. Uh, but she does a lot of uh, big M groomy and she does her own eyes. And I kind of took a cue from that. I just did like, uh, I think it was eight single crochets and a magic ring and then fastened off. And then I just did the little embroidery with the white to give it a thing. And you can see the nose on there. It's pretty cute. I don't know. I think they were cute. They were definitely, this one's definitely big. A little bigger than I probably should have made it. And I made a sweater. It's a pattern test, so I can't show you yet. Um, going to be giving it away. So I will definitely show you guys on Friday. But I will show you. I made a hat to match the sweater. So the person's going to get this. I, I don't like putting hats that I'm giving away on my head. So this is the color the sweater is. The sweater has this as um, like the bottom and the collar and the sleeves and stuff is out of the black. And this is, what was it called? Pomegranate. This is the um, Color Made Easy yarn by Lion Brand. This, I had no pattern for this. I just whipped up a hat just cause I had some leftover yarn. So I thought I'd make a hat. It does match the sweater and on by Friday, if the pattern's not released, I will come on and show you anyway but that was a hat that I whipped up. Um, I'm just looking around to see if there's anything else. I have a lot of finished objects. I just can't show anybody. So in three weeks, I did literally a sweater, a top. Um, you guys seen the Mommy Avocado. That was one of the Amigurumis. Then I did another one that I can't talk about yet. Another Amigurumi. And then I did Actually, it's still on the hook. I'm still working on it. It's a tank top. And then I did another sweater. And then I did another amigurumi. And uh, all I can say is, I it's like a... The pattern, I believe she's selling them separate. But there's a boy and a girl version. So I tested the boy version. And then she released the girl version. And she asked me if I wanted to test the girl one. It's not much different, she said. It's just the outfit is different. So I'm testing that bunny is, on, or <laughs> that one's on the hook now. I will show you guys as soon as that pattern is released. I don't know, she might release the boy pattern first and then the girl pattern. I'm not really sure how she plans to do it. Those aren't going anywhere. So I will show you those as, as the pattern's released. So that's what, that's a sweater, a top, two amigurumis, and then the, the tank top, the sweater, and then the two other amigurumis I've done. So that's eight projects, plus I am pattern testing a blanket. So that's nine patterns that I have pattern tested and the blanket I have started, but it's going to take a little bit. But it is an intermediate pattern, so I'm not sure how that's going to go. I'm going to do my best. Um, so nine patterns in three weeks that are all pattern testing. And then I've made a couple other things. I just don't remember what it is and I put them somewhere. But anyway, so I made the two B's yesterday. I decided to take a day off from the pattern testing because my brain needed a break. And I just did some something simple. So like I said, these are really cute, really simple. This same pattern of the as the big one, just different yarn, so it made it bigger. Um, so that's it, that's all I made. That's all I've done, that's all I've got, really. I have no acquisitions at all. Um, yeah, nothing. I haven't bought anything for yarn, nothing for crafting. Um, what else? Okay, so this is the video for the giveaway. I know I keep telling you guys about the giveaway. I haven't got it fully, like, full, fully sorted out yet, but I am going to give away five, uh, five gifts or five things, and they're going to be in a smaller envelope. So, you, I'm going to be able to give out five of those because shipping is kind of expensive. It will be open worldwide. Um, there will be no restrictions on that as long as on your end you can receive uh, yarn and crafting materials. Um, that's it. And I will ship it out at cost to me. But if there's any cost on your end, you will have to pay for that. That is not up to me. Nobody is sponsoring this giveaway. It is all my 
my stuff, my money, my I've purchased everything that's going to be given away. I can't show you yet what's going to be given away. So what I was going to do is I haven't bought everything yet. I'm still working on little tidbits, things that I can put in there to make it more of a giveaway, but so that I can still give away five prizes. So there will be five winners. You have to comment on this video. I am not putting it in the title. So if you don't watch the video, you won't know that there's a giveaway. I'm not going to link it. I'm not going to put giveaway so that like 50,000 people subscribe all of a sudden. I'm not doing that. So it's not going to even say anything about that. It's just going to say finish objects and chat. That's it. That's what the title of the video is going to be. So you have to comment on this video and I will pick five winners using the random YouTube comment picker. So all you got to do is be a subscriber, like the video, comment down below. Anything you want to comment doesn't matter. Just as long as the YouTube random comment picker can pick it up. Um, you have to be able to accept yarn wherever you are and, and materials that are crafting materials. I'm not sure exactly what will be in them. Um, I will pick the winner on, I'm trying to think of the date. It's got to be a Friday. I don't know what Friday is the date of the Friday. I forgot to check before I did this video. But it will be the Friday closest to the 20th. I will put it down in the description when the winners will be chosen. I have to look at the calendar, but somewhere around the 20th of August. I keep saying April. August 20th in that bracket, I will pick that Friday closest to the 20th. So if it's the 19th, it'll be that day. If it's the 21st or 22nd, the Friday, I will pick it. I will put it down below. So I'll say winners will be announced on whatever the date is closest to the 20th. Um, that way I have extra pay then so I can um, cover the cost of shipping all these packages out. So that's it. I don't have anything else. Like I said, I have a lot of finished objects. Can't show them. Uh, no acquisitions. No. Yeah, lots of. FOs, or not FOs, whips, but I actually don't have any around me, so I can't show you any. That's it. All right, guys. Well, I wanted to just hop on quick, and it's been 12 minutes of me rambling on and on about nothing. So, enter the giveaway, and um, I wish everybody a wonderful week, and I will see you guys again when I am able to show you some of my stuff. All right, take care, guys.